Joining our program now, uh, Sana Suleiman Al Mansouri, the first Amazigh TV presenter and a member of the Supreme Council of Libyan Amazigh uh, people in Libya. We will discuss with uh, Mrs. Uh, Al Suleimani or Al Mansouri the way Turkey is dealing with the Kurdish issue in the region. Welcome, Mrs. Uh, Al Mansouri, to our program. Since decades until now, Turkey is fighting the Kurds in the region in many ways. Uh, with the growing Kurdish gains in the region, um, the Turkey Turkish attacks on Kurds are increasing. Do you agree with the former president of East Timor um, that there is still a chance for Turkey to solve the Kurdish issue in Turkey, which will accordingly stop the Turkish attacks on Kurds in Rojava? Um, thank you very much. First of all, let me um, uh, allow me to pay respect to the victims. Uh, they fell in uh, Tal Tamar. Uh, um, uh, may all rest in peace and uh, uh, pay respect to the people of Rojava. Um, let's look at this um, with a, um, a historical outlook. Uh, Turkey has always been or known historically as the uh, region of Ottoman Empire. Um, although this was many years ago, um, Turkey has traditionally been a, a, an empirical state. Um, and uh, we're talking about the uh, Turkish uh, uh, government. Um, Erdogan is acting today as, uh, as if it's still an empire of uh, Ottoman uh, times. And um, I think the government has always been, uh, uh, always had aggressively uh, uh, military outlook on boarding nations and on the people who they protest in, in, in Turkey against uh, violence. They've never admitted the legitimacy of the Kurdish people or the Kurdish nations, um, uh, and they've, uh, they've, they've always denied their rights to be in, in, uh, recognized on their own lands. And um, exactly the same way the, the Arabic states did in North Africa. And I think, um, I don't think it's changed today. I don't agree uh, that uh, Turkey uh, had a chance. I think. Turkey uh, doesn't care about what's going on um, and what's happening to people. All, all Turkey cares about, or the government of Turkey cares about, is uh, its politics, its policies. The, the politics has changed. The, the propaganda took a different level, but the enemy remains the same to Turkey. At Syria today, uh, four years into the conflict, it becomes clear that the world and regional powers have uh, miscalculated the conflict in Syria, which has devastated consequences. How right were the people um, of Rojava in dealing with the conflict in Syria? Um, I think the world uh, of these big states have not only miscalculated, uh, but they uh, they. Um, um, uh, did not um, did not know Assad's system regime very well. Um, uh, let's let's think about um, why. It's very important to ask this question: Why people? There are lots of many young people join uh, ISIS in the world. Um, I think to answer the question about Rojava, we need to think about why people go to ISIS. Why these young people uh, uh, run away from states? Um, uh, and, and go to ISIS. These people are people who who have struggled with the states, with the governments on those states, uh, uh, and the, and their system. And um, they they are looking for a different life. They are looking for a different and alternative uh, way of living. ISIS, regardless its its name, it's a, 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 it's not exactly a state. They don't have a law. They don't have rules. They have a law of God. And uh, despite the, the name, these people still go there. I think Rojava is a, a great alternative to all of these dark sides, whether it's a state or a government or ISIS. I think um, Rojava created a, a light uh, combat to, 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 to combating to what's going on. I think Rojava uh, is a great uh, example. Um, it's a self-democratic uh, system that everybody dreams of, and uh, and um, uh, despite everything that's going on, it's it succeeded until today to to reach to 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 the to the level that people can live peacefully 
Um, uh, it's, a, it's an amazing society where everybody is different, but yet they still work together and, and uh, live peacefully. And uh, to prove that is what happened in Tel Tamar. Why would, uh, uh, why would they vomit? It's because it succeeded. And I think that these states are afraid of uh, Rojava as an example. See, we have taken many initiatives um, uh, to solve the Syrian conflict. In this context, there was uh, recently a congress in uh, Derek. Could Rojava succeed in its attempts, um, given the fact that they succeeded in building a democratic system uh, in the region? I think they do. I think they did. Uh, uh, I think they need support. Um, many, many delegations visited Rojava, and I think uh, from talking about um, uh, what happened in, in the Congress that, uh, that uh, took uh, place uh, uh, these couple of days uh, in Rojava, I think uh, it, we need to support people uh, in Rojava, we need to support this, this Congress, uh, and, um, and I think uh, with, uh, to make sure that um, that uh, the uh, in interventions of Turkey um, uh, should not succeed in Rojava. That um, the Rojava people have to continue doing what they're doing. Uh, I think Turkey needs to get out of Iraq and it needs to get out of the whole uh, thing because um, what they're doing in there is not. Uh, uh, is not on the side of, uh, of Rojava or looking for peace or a dialogue. This is all uh, too late for Turkey to, to, be, to, to do that. And I think people of Rojava need to sit down. I think uh, the solution is not uh, a, an aggressive one. It's a political one. Uh, and, uh, and I think uh, if we need to continue supporting uh, Rojava people and, uh, and the self-democratic um, system that they're building um, I think they're doing very well. Uh, I wish the rest of the countries uh, in the Middle East take Rojava as an example and work together against uh, those big states that they want to rule over. Sana Suleiman Al Mansouri, the first Amazigh TV presenter in Libya and member of the Supreme Council of uh, the Libyan Amazigh people in Libya. Thank you very much for joining our program.